It's a pleasure for me to take part in the kickoff of the National Eye Care Program, having been nearsighted all my life and worn glasses from the time I was a boy. Uh, this kind of public and private uh, sector cooperation strengthens our country and enriches the quality of, of life. This program is volunteerism at its best. One group of Americans offering care to another. We're seeing this kind of neighborly generosity with increasing frequency today. The Academy of Ophthalmologists can be proud of its leadership role in the movement. Under the sponsorship of the Academy, hundreds of individual doctors have volunteered to ensure that our elderly citizens receive eye care. I even qualify on that score, too. <laughs> <laughs> Many other individuals and firms have donated thousands of dollars worth of time and material to assist the project. And stars like <coughs> Cary Grant, Gene Kelly, and James Messon, all from my previous existence, <laughs> have volunteered to make radio and television messages to, with help from Warner Brothers and Kaiser Industries, and the, and I hope I pronounce this correctly, the Mitre Corporation of uh, Bedford, Massachusetts, designed and uh, provided a computerized communications network for the project. The Apple Corporation provided computers and many others have also given generously. So everyone involved in this wonderful project deserves the heartfelt thanks of their fellow citizens. But I especially want to recognize Dr. Tom Hutchinson of Boston, the driving force behind the National Eye Care Project. It was his dream and dedication that inspired hundreds of his medical colleagues to participate. And would Dr. Hutchison please step forward so we can give you the recognition. <laughs> you. I congratulate you all and thank you all very much. And if any of you who are dealing in that business want to have any suggestions for people who have a problem with their contact lenses, <laughs> I can give you one little personal experience here that you might pass on to them. In order, without putting on reading glasses, being nearsighted, to read that, I found out that if I take out one, I can read the notes. <laughs> but with the other eye, I'm seeing all of you. <laughs> a little gimmick I learned out of the mashed potato circuit. <laughs> <laughs> but again, thank you all very much. I think this is, is just wonderful. We appreciate your time. Thank you. Thank you. I think it is a time for uh, socializing. The sun certainly is over the yard arm if it's up there any place <laughs> above those clouds. I just greeted a half a dozen arriving ambassadors and tried to assure each one of them that it didn't rain all the time in Washington. But um, I just want to thank all of you. I know what you've all done and I know that there are many of you here who have, 
are contributing time and effort as, as well as other kinds of contributions. And I want to thank you. I don't know of all the private initiative uh, efforts that we have going forward, none of them are closer to my heart uh, than this one. And uh, Nancy and I just want you to know how much we appreciate it and how happy we are that you're here. And God bless you all and thank you for what you're doing. Thank you.